the sunscreen said uh, no like uh, no white gas at all so we're gonna try and see okay so I just received this mineral sunscreen okay and I just wanted to use this mineral sunscreen with you guys and show you if it's really dark skin approved so the one thing that I have on my face I apply my serum I apply my oil free moisturizer if you don't know I have a acne or acne prone skin okay so we it's time for me to apply my sunscreen and I think before uh, I apply this on my face it said I have to shake you have to shake this one and some of the thing about this sunscreen is untainted no show zinc oxide okay it hydrate soften and smooth the skin i just received it and i wanted to try this in front of you guys so together we're gonna discover if this thing is really really as they said okay so okay i'm not gonna apply one to me let's see how it is it's really liquidy you see it's really really liquidy it remind me of uh la roche posay sun sunscreen hmm. let me get closer to you guys so you can see No white gas. We are going to see that one right now. Very curious, okay. Sometimes those sunscreen, especially mineral sunscreen, when you massage them too much, they start to peel on you, okay. So this thing is running, okay. It's raw running, okay, running. So it's it's really liquidy, liquidy. Don't forget the neck, the neck, the neck. Okay. I think I apply a good amount on my neck. I need to add a little bit more on my face. It doesn't feel greasy and I like that. It doesn't feel greasy. I feel like if you are, if you are oily skin prone like me this can work for you as well so let's see on the eyes yeah you're trying to fire your on the eyes the dark dark necks dark necks and stuff like that you need to apply your sunscreen under your eyes guys especially mineral sunscreen chemical sunscreen it depends it may burn you so you have to be cautious but mineral sunscreen i feel like it's safe so this is the result guys after a massage this is my face at the front this is the side this is my face you can see my airline yeah this is the side So I'm going to let it set for 10 minutes or 15 minutes time for me to get dressed and I come back and give you my verdict. Okay guys, so let me share with you my final thought about this sunscreen and what I really think about it. The sunscreen said no show mineral sunscreen. I think you can clearly see that I have something on my face, right? It's it's, it still have a white cast but it's really it's minimal and I think that I can work with it for me it's fine okay I'm not really picky about it but for me it's fine okay it's really fine for me and I think I can handle it I think I can use it and I feel like it's, it's not really a no-show but they are, it's close to okay it's close to they came up with something good it's, it's really close to so this shot <laughs> This sunscreen from Colors Science remind me of La Roche-Posay sunscreen, this one. 
the uh, the consistency of the product is really similar to La Roche Posay. Mm -hmm. This one doesn't feel greasy at all, and I did like it when I apply on my face. It doesn't feel greasy at all, and the feel on on your hands, it, it really feels like it's like it's water. I mean, it it feels really hydrating. That's why I would say. If you have dry skin, you need to moisturize your face very well before applying this sunscreen. If you have oily skin, I would say still apply your oil-free moisturizer before applying this sunscreen. Unless your face is really greasy and oily and you don't want to add anything, I think it can work too. So for me, this sunscreen can work for all type of skin. This thing is not a moisturizer, it's not going to moisturize your face at all. It's really like a sunscreen, okay? And I like that. I, I like that. Uh, for me, I, I like that. So, do I recommend this sunscreen? I would say yes, I do recommend it if you have a dark skin. But again, it's going to leave you a minimal, minimal, minimal cask. Sorry about it. It's going to leave you a little bit mi minimum cast. So yeah, I have another sunscreen that I really, really like. It doesn't leave me no white cast at all. Okay. I love that sunscreen. At the beginning, I didn't love it, but I love that sunscreen now. I think I'm going to make a review about it so you can also use it and try it if you're somebody that, that is looking for mineral sunscreen. So uh, I would give to that sunscreen 4 over 5, okay? For me, it's a 4 over 5. On the makeup, I don't know how it works on the makeup. So you will you will need to do that on your own. But I just want to show you how it looks out of the box, okay? The presentation. I can go out just like this. I can go out, no problem, okay? If you want to hide, if you want to hide uh, that line of demarcation i can just apply like a powder or something and that's it so thank you guys i hope you like this video and i see you in my next video bye bye